today we're talking about something that's quite important in reading palms and that is looking at the quality of the lines. A good quality line is obviously one that hasn't got flaws or stars or crosses or bars or chaining. So um, the quality of the line is really important to analyse what's going on in the person's life when you're giving a palm reading. So today we will discuss the chain line and I will talk about the three main lines, the heart line, head line and the life line. Don't forget to subscribe and please visit destinypalmistry.com for more articles and lots more information you can learn from there, as well as enter to win my ebooks. That is also from the website. Go in there, win free palmistry books. Put your name in there and every time I get 100 new subscribers, I will draw two winners. We already had two last week, so that was great. All right, I shall put that presentation on for you now and I'll see you next time. Bye. Hi, thank you for joining me today. We are talking about chained lines. And what that means is a line on the palm that appears to be like a chain or it has many, many crosses throughout to make it blurred or kind of fuzzy. So the first one we are going to talk about is the chained heart line. That is the most common line to appear chained because it shows restlessness um, in the emotions. So feelings are restless. That can be caused by many different reasons, but usually it is on a hand that is soft skin or a water hand. That is a long, narrow palm with soft skin often comes with a chained heart line. So don't panic. It's um, probably quite normal for you. What it generally means is somebody has unstable emotions. So their feelings are not steady. They may get upset easily. They may become moody easily. They're hypersensitive in their feelings. So their feelings are hurt easily. So whereas if somebody um, insulted me, for instance, I have a nice smooth heart line. If somebody insulted me, I would just shrug it off or laugh at them. Um, somebody with a chained line or a fuzzy heart line, they may not know how to accept it so gracefully. And on the other side, it can show disruptions in love life. So if the person has had many relationships that just don't work out, they keep breaking up for some reason or another, that can show up as a chained line, or usually there's lots of little lines coming away from the heart line. So that is what a chained heart line means. Sometimes it's only at the beginning of the line. I'll see if I can get a little um, highlighter here going. So the beginning of the line starts at the pinky end. So if it's only chained here where I'm highlighting, that's very normal because um, as a child, you're not sure of your emotions because you're not ready for the world and relationships. So that's quite normal to be chained there. Okay, let's move on to the headline. And here is a headline. The meaning of it when it is fuzzy is a little bit more negative than the heart line because it's not as normal to have a fuzzy headline. Whereas I said before, if you have a sensitive hand, if you have a long narrow palm with soft skin, it may be common to have that chained heart line. However, the headline shows your thinking. So if it's fuzzy or chained all the way through, that shows that you really struggle concentrating. You are probably mentally lazy. Um, so 
all tired, just can't think, very, very tired all the time, chronic fatigue. If you are taking drugs or alcohol too much of, that can affect your mind, which then affects the headline, which depicts your mind. On some cases, it can be one of the signs of depression. Um, please don't take it as a single sign of any of those. Always look to the other lines for clues. But if it were going to be depression, the headline would most likely be much longer. I'll draw a little line down here. And it would reach down towards the mountain moon. So it would be a deeply bending, curving line. And that would depict um, a moody person as well. So um, when the headline is fuzzy, that also affects the moods of the person because their mentality. So they can be the same. We'll do one more line, and that is the chained lifeline. It's common to be chained at the beginning because. Um, lack of focus or difficulty becoming independent as a child. You don't normally instantly be an independent person from a young age. So, you know, you, you gradually mature. So it's quite normal to be fuzzy or chained at the beginning. So don't panic. If, however, it stretches further beyond that, that is a sign of stress. There is uh, reduced energy probably because of the stress. There may be nervousness, probably because of the stress. And it can also depict a weak constitution. So someone who gets sick easily. So obviously you have to look to the other lines. If it is mental stress, the headline might show some marks. If it's emotional stress, the heart line might show some marks. And if the person just literally has had a difficult life, it'll show as a chained line. And often when you have this, it smooths out. So after a period, suddenly the line goes smooth. And that's a sign that they finally get their things sorted out. Whatever was their issue, they have that sorted out and the line continues nice and smooth. So that's a positive mark there. There you have it. I hope you've enjoyed that little lesson on fuzzy lines, chain lines, and I look forward to doing another one soon. See ya. Bye.